good morning. <laughs> it's wet. Look at it. Look at it. Look. We've had a lot of rain. <coughs> Hello guys, alright? Second vid of the week. I'm doing well so far. <laughs> I don't know whether I'm going to keep it up, but I'll try my best. Um. <laughs> if it don't rain, I haven't got my waterproof coat on and it got me um, hoodie. Thank you to my wife for this one for Christmas. Look, it's nice and warm. It's got a nice um, thick lining in it. Just for the camper, really. But, um, so I can save on heat, you see. <laughs> I don't have to have the heating on. I can um, I can stick my nice hoodie on and just sit in the van without having to waste any money on gas. But what a good idea! I like that. <laughs> <coughs> well, I've realised a lot of the time nowadays we um, we heat our houses, don't we? And you're thinking, what are you heating your house for? You're heating your house to heat yourself. You think, We'll put a jumper on. <laughs> do you know what I mean? That's what my mum used to do. I used to say, oh, I'm cold. We'll put a jumper on then. You know, it's, you think, it's not rocket science, is it? You know, you think, well, I'll sit here in a... T Mind you, it is quite nice to sit in a T-shirt sometimes. <laughs> but just don't make a hell out of it. If you, you know, if, um, I think we get used to things, don't we? You know? We get used to lots of stuff, and um, I think we we become quite wasteful. I think really. Right, so you don't need a house. You don't need to heat a whole house, do you? Um, and we don't have any heating upstairs in our house. Um, we've only got heating in the front room and the kitchen. Oh, and the bathroom as well. Um, and that's it. That's all we got. Let's drop it over again. Yeah, that's all we got. I don't like a hot bedroom. I can't sleep in it. It's too hot. I get too fussy. Too, um... You know... Whatever that is. <laughs> flustered, is it? No, it's not flustered, is it? I don't know what it is. You know what I mean. Whatever it is. <laughs> it's whatever it is. Can you hear the birds? It's lovely, isn't it? Ah, nice. There's a nice frequency in here. <laughs> I was looking into frequencies today. Uh, well, last few days actually. Just out of interest. And, um, yes, there's, um, there's a lot to be said about frequencies of things. Well, everything, everything is a frequency really, isn't it? Sort of, in a kind of way. Whether it be light or sound or whatever. Um, I really want to get myself a, one of those Tibetan singing bowls. I love them. I absolutely love those singing bowls. They're, they're just so good. I, I tend to listen to them when I meditate and stuff as well. And um, there's just something that's so magical about a singing bowl. So um, I'm going to try and get one if I can. I know there's lots of cheap ones on eBay. But, um, I, don't, I think they're probably a bit fake. I don't think they'll work as well as they should. Because they're all tuned to a certain frequency, aren't they? You know, if they're, um, if they're like pressed out in a factory in China somewhere, I don't think they're probably going to have the same effect. Um, I'm keeping my eye out for a second hand one because they're really expensive. If you buy a decent one, I think they're about £60 plus. Um, so I want to try and get a sort of a medium sized one. The little ones are nice, but they, they do more of a higher tone rather than a sort of medium tone, if you see what I mean. So, uh, yes, that'd be nice. So, if any of you guys know anybody. Um, know anywhere that sells them at a good price then um, leave it in the comments and uh, I'll go and have a look yeah thanks for the comments on the last vid oh sorry I don't reply to all the comments 
Um, I do read every single one, but um, <coughs> I don't always get a chance to reply to everyone. Because um, I have a few channels and stuff, I, um, I do get an awful, awful lot of comments. Especially on, um, especially over on Scudo, because obviously they're, it's coming up to the 400 vid over there on Scudos, and um, I'm finding it very difficult to reply to. <laughs> it can take me a long time. Like some days I'll sit down and I could be there for an hour just replying to comments, you know. So. Um, some days I just don't get the chance. Like I might, one particular week I might put up a video and not reply at all. But it's um, it's not for lack of reading. I do read them all. So thank you very much for leaving them if you do. So I do read them. So keep them coming. Because <laughs> I do read them. I usually thumb them up, you see. I'll just put a thumb up. If I, if I don't get a chance to reply, then um, I'll just put a thumb up. So if you've got a thumb up next to your comment, that probably means I've already read it. So thank you. <laughs> <coughs> so yeah, frequencies, eh? Yeah, that's what I was reading the other day as well. But, um... Middle, is it middle C or something? I'm no musician, alright? I know absolutely nothing about music. But, um, I was reading somewhere that there's, they reckon there's some sort of conspiracy on the middle C, I think. Um, being 440 hertz. Because, um, I've got into, uh, I've done a bit of research on numerology as well. Which is quite interesting. Very interesting, actually. If you look at the way numbers work, number 12 and all this sort of stuff. I'm not going to go into it now, but yeah, it's very interesting. And um, numerology in the matrix. <laughs> and um, yeah, it's very interesting. Anyway, this, uh, this 440 hertz, um, it looks like it's been adapted to a metal C, I think. It might contain, I might have read it wrong, but... And, um, I reckon originally it should have been 336, um, which is a, more of a magic number, if you see what I mean. And, uh, I looked at the, um, the science behind it all and the maths and stuff and I thought, oh yeah, okay, it does make a lot of sense that, um, it should be 336. And do you think I can find any videos on YouTube with the frequency 336? No. <laughs> I thought, why? I thought it was a bit weird. Because the maths of the numerology ties it to 336 hertz. But, um, for some reason it's either not 300, 400. 400. 436. Um, it's either 432 hertz or 440. Um, not 436. Which, um, which I thought was a bit strange. I thought, I wonder why. But, um, if any of you guys do meditation, um, like I do myself, I do find the 440 and 432 is very relaxing. I do, um, I do tend to zone out quite nicely on that. You sort of tune in somehow. Um, um, my, uh, the other research I was doing as well, um, I wasn't quite sure, but I was looking at Wi-Fi's, and apparently Wi-Fi and stuff like that, those sort of frequency, the wireless network, they also seem to be using within the 400 400 hertz frequency range um, and I thought well if that's the case isn't that going to disrupt us somewhat do you know what I mean is that not going to knock us out of equilibrium are we not going to be in that peaceful place maybe do you know what I mean and, um, I don't know 
Uh, any, any of you guys, if you're into electronics or anything like that, please put me right if I'm wrong. Um, but I believe it's in the 400 hertz range. Um, if not, let me know, please. Because I'd really like to know. Um, because uh, it's really interesting stuff. Peacefulness and bird song. I don't know what frequency that is, but it's bloody lovely. <laughs> right, I'm going. Um, yeah, have a good weekend, guys. Hope you had a great week. <sighs> Peace in every step. There's Ellie. <laughs> and um, me and Els. See you next vid. So, have a good weekend. <laughs>